So I recently uploaded my phone collection for March 2017 and at the end of that video I told you guys that I would take it down and re-upload another one but I would like to apologize because that's not going to happen. See I already did another one but the one that I did consisted of too many clips like 50 clips and that's just like stop and go stop and go like like a certain phone then stop, a certain phone then stop if you know what I mean. But with that being said, this is what's on my phone for March 2017. So this is actually going to be a unique video because I'm not featuring just one phone like you see in front of you. I'm going to feature two phones. So let's start with this one. This one is my Samsung Galaxy Luna. And... If you can see here, I do have a case on it now. And if the quality looks better or in any way, that's because I'm recording with my iPhone 5S. And this is a body glove case. You can see right there. Very nice looking case for the Galaxy Luna. Looks very tough, looks very stylish. But yeah. So for my lock screen, I have the basic lock screen. And as for the background, this is just a plain black background. And I don't have any sort of lock on it right now. So just swipe in any direction. And we're in. So here's my main page. So up here we got the weather widget, which is currently in the updated really quick. 79 degrees over here in Movell. And we have the clock along with it. One single widget. The Google widget. We can search for... Let me think of what to search for. Okay, Google. What's the weather going to be like tomorrow? Tomorrow's forecast for Moreno Valley is 85 degrees and... You can't hear it, but it... You, can, you couldn't hear it, but it said what the temperature will be tomorrow out loud. My volume is just turned down. So here we have text now, which basically... It's kind of self-explanatory. Uh, it's basically like a free calling and texting app. I will not go into it because I have some phone numbers in there that I don't want to display. Next app over here is OfferUp. This is basically where I buy and sell and trade things. And as you can see, it says getting location, loading offers. And this is usually wrong half the time. So go up to filter my location. Let me insert my, insert my, oh, I don't mean 9, no, I don't mean 92554, I mean 92557. I always flick it down to 5 miles and just basically that, apply. And it basically grabs whatever offers that are nearby. And let's go through here really quick and find something. Oh, here's a phone. See, uh, iPhone 6, Mint. And let's see, Reno Valley, but it doesn't give give us a um, approximate or exact location but they're in Moreno Valley somewhere no I will not be purchasing that phone I'm just giving you a general idea of what this app is so up here you got a little magnifying glass you can search for whatever you want let's just go over here I these are the things I searched for before say Samsung Galaxy Luna which is this phone right here and there you go then you have a little camera button where you can post and offer it. You can either take a photo or select a photo. Pretty self-explanatory. And go through the screens here. So let's just say Samsung Galaxy Luna. Done. Next. Well, it's it asked me to take a photo take a photo of it or select a photo. Let's go ahead and do this really quick so I can show you, you know. Just default it to the front camera so there you go and yes I'm using my iPhone if you didn't catch what I just said in the beginning so you just let's say that's the Galaxy Luna press next choose the category let's just say general because well I'm not a phone and then you just describe your item pretty self-explanatory there and then you can say your price any price literally you could be, you want to be firm you just check that you can go all the way down here to the condition. All the way to the left is other C description for parts, used normal wear, 
open box never used reconditioned certified or new never used my stuff is usually right here default and then you press next well I think it um, says post if I'm not mistaken but I haven't done this in a while I haven't posted anything go here's uh, over here is your sidebar you get there's me right there that's this is my my um, account you tap on that it it'll take you to my profile loading offers and there you go yes I am selling my phones and I've had a couple people say um can I buy a certain phone off of you for cash but I m mentioned this in a previous video you have to be in Merino Valley I cannot travel and you have to be close by so yeah home you just saw home it's this is what it looks like uh, categories you can ch choose from virtually anything search everything popular near me from people I follow baby and kids furniture clothing and shoes cars and trucks household cell phones electronics jewelry and accessories games and toys appliances collectibles antiques general tools and machinery beauty and health boats and marine and sports and outdoors and the list goes on and on as you can see here quite a bit of selection to choose from and then alerts this is basically where you go like let's say if somebody commented on something saying they like to buy it uh, go over here to hidden alerts I've hidden a lot of them so let's just say this one is my most recent one let's go ahead and unhide that go back this is what it will look like and tap on it and it'll give you information and to hide it you just tap and hold on it and just say hide it'll go right here and there it is at the top going back to the sidebar go to my offers is basically what I just showed you but um, we try there you go here's my offers a lot of them and then over here is your buying is what you commented on and I have a, quite a few here and some of these I have to archive let's just go ahead and do that right now and speak excuse me speak, speaking of which you tap on it and it'll give you some options and here's your item description is what the item is you can either view it share it message or view messages or archive it I'll just go ahead and archive it and these down here these four specifically are, are sold I got most of them except for this one down here um, I might be getting this phone right here the LG I just don't know when and then here's what I'm currently watching you just tap on one and you can see that red heart right there that means I'm watching it you just move this way a little bit uh, if I untap it removed from watch list if I tap it save to watch list and it, it'll appear right here and then you can uh, pay with like a credit card a debit card or Apple pay if I'm not mistaken you can see payment methods add credit debit card and yeah you insert your credit or debit card I don't need to do this because I can't and don't have to help center basically report a problem haven't had to went back you pay seller or you can invite a friend and here's a little gear icon up here for the settings and I'm currently at 11 ratings and about four stars out of five it's not bad and that's basically my YouTube image right there I'm not a true you member uh, what's true you you might ask true you is um, well you pause to read that right there that should be long enough uh, you can view your public profile settings or about or down here you can see log out oh, categories sorry going back home next we have YouTube we all know what YouTube is we go on it nearly every day I know I do even at school I go on it then we have snapchat I'm currently logged into snapchat right now on this phone because it is my main phone and it is and it's featured on what's on my phone and I know I didn't make sense but this is a, this Galaxy Luna is what I'm trying to use for a couple days. Doesn't have the best camera, but it's pretty it's pretty okay for stuff like this. Here's your stories, of course. I have two to look at. Double tap. There I am. Hello. And yeah, there's 
people. There's my chat. As you can see, I have no activity, but yeah. Next, we have kick. I may have already went over this in a different video. Only have one chat. You guys should know what kick is. It's just a messaging app. Then we have the Play Store, where I can download tons of apps, as you guys really should know. Um, Full-fledged Play Store. Then as for my dog down here, I have phone. You should know what that is. Basically, the system apps, phone, messaging, internet, and all apps. The app drawer right here. Uh, here's what my phone looks like. Messaging, or messages. Then we have your internet. Google.com. There we go. Matter of fact, let me go ahead and clear out my multitasking just to make it quicker and faster. Having to hold my phone really weirdly for this video. I apologize, but it looks it looks good in my opinion. <clears throat> now before we go into um, all apps or the app drawer, I do have another page. So here we have your messenger, which half a million people probably use in this world. It's newly updated. There's my conversations. They implemented this feature where you can basically you know take pictures and whatnot back and yeah basic messenger then we have the Best Buy app I occasionally go on here to see if there's any deals or not products let's take a look really quick why not products cell phones prepaid phones all prepaid phones so there is some within my price range my price is actually quite a lot because I have been saving up my money. Don't know which device I'm going to get for the next unboxing and review. So that's actually going to be a mystery. And I still don't even, do, still don't even know what, what it's going to be. Next we have Pandora. Now this is the free version. And hopefully it doesn't pop up with a song. It might, but... Oh yeah, there you go. Dark Horse by Katy Perry. And... Yeah, I went over this in a previous video. Well, I mean, a while ago, but anyway. Instagram. Come on now, we all know what Instagram is. Shout out to uh, Rick Morrison. Here's my feed. Really quick. If you'd like to follow me on Instagram, here's my profile. And as always, the links are down below in the description. As with every video, they are. Two recommended people or new suggestions. Let's go ahead and dismiss them really quick. These are actually quite um, distracting. So, yeah. I haven't posted one in a long time. Uh, this is the most recent one, and this was on February 22nd. And I get a pretty mediocre amount of likes. I only have about four likes on this um, photo, and I have about 90 followers. Very appreciative of. I'm following 64, and I have 78 posts, so not quite at 100 yet. And then we have your system settings there's really no need to actually talk about this we have your camera same we don't need to really talk about this what's up come back home we have your gallery uh, still I don't even have any true photos on here this is just wallpapers that I've saved from miscellaneous wallpaper apps and what do you know a bottle of milk for wallpaper why not and then for these pages we have the last app which is Battery Doctor and you may have met, you may have heard me mention this over and over again but I only like to open this app when I'm you know charging a phone so yeah this app helps you save battery and all that good stuff and boost your phone and whatnot clear out these really quick you can see this Luna is pretty fast I enjoy it. And as for the apps that I did not feature or, yeah, feature, here we have your Google folder. It's all stock. Samsung folder, it's all stock. My files, voice recorder, email, internet, Galaxy apps, Samsung Milk Music, which I never use, but I might try it sometime. I just don't know when. Calculator, calendar, clock, contacts. Sorry, I'm scrolling up and down. What am I thinking? Uh, memo, my account downloader. Off-road 4x4 Mountain, which is a car game, um, and 
Wi-Fi utility. And that's basically it on the Galaxy Luna. Now on to the second phone. Okay, here's the second phone, the LG Rebel. So, uh, as for the case, I have another body glove on it, as you can see right there. Let me see if I can get it to focus. Yeah, you can't really see it, but it says body glove. Very nice case. I mean, I it's okay for this phone. Uh, it's not really the best looking case. I know that for sure, but it serves its purpose. And I don't know if you heard that, but I got some offer up notifications and etc. Because before I started this clip, I had to turn the Wi-Fi on because it wasn't on already. So yeah, as for the lock screen, I have the basic system lock screen, and I do have a. Let me focus back in really quick. I do have a a pin lock, and this is my pin five two seven five. And yeah, excuse that. Alright, so let's get started with this one. This is my main page on the LG Rebel. I only have the Google app, which I just showed you on the Galaxy Luna, which happens to be right over there. And here's Pandora. It's the only app up here. It's the new Pandora, not the old one. Let me just show you here. There you go. Didn't even pop up with a song, which is nice. All my stations. Basically the same as the old Pandora. And then, we basically have the same apps on this one. YouTube, Snapchat, Kick, Play Store. For the dock, we have your phone, contacts, app drawer, messages, and camera. And for the second page, we got the music widget, which I should have some music on here other than that. One, two, three, four, five, six. I have six songs on here, apparently. Clear all. Uh, then we have um, uh, my account from TrackPhone. This is the app that I use to track my minutes and everything. My minutes, my data, and my texts. See if we got any updates really quick. Just press and hold refresh. And it doesn't look like anything happened. But as you can see right here, I do indeed have 7.29 gigabytes of data. And I have 179 minutes remaining and 140 texts remaining. That's because the reason why I have so much data is because every time I go to Walmart, I usually get a $10 one gigabyte of data card so and as you can see there oh one point or seven point forty three it actually increased that's weird yeah just there's my phone number please don't call me but yeah that's my phone number and star up here is if I want to make this the default device you can't see it it's in black it says make LG Rebel LTE the default device I don't want to matter of fact I've been actually trying to switch for to another device like, like deactivate this one and switch to another one, another track phone, but I haven't been successful. And as you can see here, my service ends uh, 6, 7, uh, 2017. Sidebar over here, a lot of options here. Dashboard, profile, notification history, add new device, add airtime for a friend, manage credit cards, Wi-Fi optimizer, support and more, share feedback, store locator, and log out. So there's track phone in. Down here you can either add airtime, buy airtime, or enroll in auto refill. And over here, I, I don't even know what this section is called. My phone number again, inactive, I don't know what that means. And then we have the same text now app, followed by offer up, same app. Then we have a 10,000 wallpapers app, which before I get into that, I am just using a plain black wallpaper for this one as well. But this is actually a true black wallpaper. like. Matter of fact, to get a black wallpaper, all you have to do is freaking cover up the camera, the rear camera or the front camera. P.S. The rear camera works best because it's usually higher megapixels than the front camera. So yeah, that's basically all I did and there you go, black background, make your phone run better. But yeah, 10,000 wallpapers is pretty self-explanatory. You get a massive selection of wallpapers to choose from with these tabs up here all the way to the left categories you can choose from sky green pink orange yellow purple black blue gray red white and color right for that recommended tabs right here users uploaded girls favorite boys favorite and lock screen and down here categories you got all these categories here 
Might as well go over them really quick like. Actors, actresses, animals, anime, art, basketball, black and white, brands, calendars, cars, cartoons, cats, celebrities, colors, country, cute, dogs, fashion, flower, food, funny, games, girls, holidays, illustrations, landscapes, love, monogram, motivational, movies, music, nature, pink, quotes, soccer, space, spiritual, spiritual, sports, TV shows, textures, and USA. To give you a rundown and as you can see here this is my daily this is the tab that I was just on and yes it does have ads just so you know this is what's hot right now apparently you scroll through there featured fancy galaxy crazy games MAR for March I don't mean to click that outline drawings uh, the Oscars 2017 hello spring love all-star New Orleans 2017 February, watercolor, and inspirational quotes, and etc. And this is what I liked, but apparently I have nothing liked. So there's that. System settings. Basic settings. Messenger, the same messenger. Gallery. Here's my screenshots. I actually meant to tap the um, camera roll icon, or this top one, but I tapped the bottom one first. Basically, this is a time where, when we were in Rialto. Here's a time that I did a speed test at home at 11.05 p.m. With my internet turned on, location turned on, had headphones plugged in. My speed is uh, about 41.34 megabits per second download and 8.14 upload at the time. And then this was another one with, I think, the same connection here at home. And... That's pretty pathetic. I don't know what the hell happened there. But that has to be my best get. That internet is here. Or, I might be mistaken, that might be from Walmart. That's been quite a while ago. Download is my YouTube image for my wallpaper. Then, just here's a black wallpaper. I'm actually getting out of breath because I'm having to talk quite fast, but I realize I need to slow down when I talk. Then here's my 10,000 wallpaper apps, which I just saved. Very nice looking wallpaper, and I know you can barely see it down here, but that's because the focus on the iPhone isn't um, isn't really working correctly. Here's another one, looks pretty fancy, and then there's that one. As for the camera, I only have four. Uh, here's one, Pizza Chef, no, Pizza Place in Riverside. There's a video, another video, and another wallpaper. That's my gallery, Instagram, usual Instagram, the same you just saw on the Luna. And now as for the apps I didn't show, you got browser, calculator, calendar, clock, uh, downloads, email, emergency alerts, file manager, and music, um, Nova Launcher. I do have Nova Launcher, but I'm not running it. This is a stock launcher, stock launcher for the Luna as well. Can give you an idea of how my setup is on Nova Launcher. There you go, it looks very clean looking, but I actually prefer the stock launcher for now. Let's clear these out just to make the phone faster. Oh, come on, I mistapped something. Then we have, let's see here, Quick Memo Plus, Speed Test, Tasks, Voice Command, Voice Recorder, and Wi-Fi Utility. Let's go in. Uh, speed test and let's see how fast my internet is at this uh, very time Begin test that fast and boy, I really hope I can actually upload this video and I should be getting much faster than that I should get I should literally not joking be getting about 70 or so megabits per second at least 50 at that But apparently that's what I'm getting right now so if you didn't see, I, I just said I was recording with my iPhone 5S for the first time. And if this actually works out, this might actually be my new YouTube camera. Who knows? But there you go. 42.7 or 75 for the download. And the upload is 12.52 with a ping of 11 right up here. As for my results, I did multiple tests, as you can see here. Most recent one I just showed you. And the first test I did was on, uh, on data. 
I got 5.12 megabits per second down and 2.26 up with a ping of 28. So not too shabby for date for you know uh, whatever I was pulling at the time. And that looks to be about it. So I hope you guys enjoyed my what's on my phone. It's actually a, um, it's actually you know two phones and not just one because these devices I use the most here lately, or I use these devices more than any others. So I hope you enjoyed this video as much as I actually did making it, and that's actually surprising coming from me because I rarely am satisfied with how my videos turns out. But honestly, if I can upload this one, this shall be a good video so yeah be sure to check out my most recent upload on the left and also my channel icon on the right click that to subscribe and you hopefully won't be disappointed anyway guys that about does it for this video and i'll see you in the next one